Refrain. Yo. Hey guys, it's Corellus. Welcome back. This is a new house behind me and this is a house actually built by request because a lot of people have messaged me that they wanted a really small modern house which could be placed in a lot which is 16 by 16 uh, blocks so if you don't count the big tree here the house itself is actually a very small house which is in a 16 by 16 lot uh, the thing is guys uh, that this is not a tutorial it's basically a let's build uh, I changed tons of stuff uh, along the way I think so Hopefully you can still still understand what I'm doing, and if you want the schematic, you can just go on Corellus.net and get grab the schematic because it's there. I will just give you a short tour on the inside. As you can see, we have a small downstairs area here. Uh, I just carved out this. This is not shown in the in the movie. I just did that now. And uh, small downstairs area. We have a one room here which can be used as a bedroom or something. I didn't build using the shader mod because it's really hard to see. I've tried it but didn't work that well so I built without the shader mod. This is a upstairs area which can be used as a bedroom or something. We have a be small balcony here on the outside which is pretty neat, pretty nice. And I just deleted something there but that doesn't matter. It was leaves! As you can see it's very pretty and that's Keralis pixel art over there. The noob. And let me see, let me see, go on, come down here, we have one more room which is just the same as the above one here, really small, can you be used as a bathroom or something. And we have a basement here, I'm just gonna put on some light, otherwise it will be very hard for you guys to see what I'm doing in here. And there's a small, small area here which can be used as a storage area or something. Well, I won't furnish the house, it's all up to you, so grab the schematic and get crazy or just build the house after this. Let's build! I'm just gonna put on some light and I will go outside to show you guys one more spin around the house. So hopefully you will enjoy, please do comment, like or subscribe if you haven't and I will see you in the next video. Take care guys! So guys, this is the area I've chosen, it's a beautiful area here on the peninsula and this is the lot. It's 16 by 16 and within the bushes it's 15 by 15. And uh, hopefully this is the size that people requested. Well, hopefully it's correct size. Well, nothing, no thing to less. As you can see, I got a lot of crap here on me uh, from the previous build. So I'm just gonna throw it all away. I'm gonna pick some glass, sandstone, wooden planks. What do we need anymore? White wool. You know, that's my favorite materials to, to use when building. So I'm gonna just pick those for now. Oops, wooden planks I already had. Uh, maybe some cobblestone. Do, 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 do. Oh, glowstone. How can I forget glowstone? Glowstone is cool. Glowstone is cool. And um, double, 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 double. Let me see. Double. Couple steps. Nope. No, not double. Couple steps. I need stone slabs. Double stone slabs. Where are you? There we go. All right. So let's get building. Uh, whoa. Uh, as you can see, my idea of the house is basically something like this. I got an idea here up in my head, which is will be something like this. So there will be a small area of the house coming out here, there will be two floors here and a basement beneath. And I will leave this area of the lot because I will, would like to plant a tree in this area maybe. Uh, well, that's the idea. So this is how the house will look like. Hopefully. So let's get cracking. Uh, let's plant three in height, of course make a space for a window here there will be a door frame here she the lot is actually smaller than i thought it's a lot smaller than i thought so hopefully it will fit the idea i'm thinking so we actually need to turn this around i was thinking about going here but as the lot is so small i'm gonna need to turn on this block here Actually, I'm gonna do it like this. I'm gonna place a double window here. And that might look cool when it's done. Alright, so skip one and some glowstone. 
glowstone, glowstone, glowstone. There we go. Okay. Uh, and do the same on the other side, maybe. That might maybe change. I don't know at the moment, but well, let's let's do it for now. I'm just gonna bring grab my wand as well, and then just grab it to here. Uh, there we go. All right. So now we got the wand and. I was thinking about adding stairs, but the problem is the stairs won't cut it here, so I will have to bring it to the back maybe somewhere. So I'm just gonna do it like this for now and see. Alright, so the stairs will be coming here. And usually I do stairs like this. I put two stairs, I put a block here, and I put stairs again. But this won't work in this case because it's six blocks here in width, so we have to make a pillar in the middle, which is two blocks in width. All right, so let me just see. The first stairs will be coming here. Oh, actually, we're gonna take up the stairs here, and this will be the basement stairs. All right, so make a pillar to cover up the stairs here. I don't know. Will this look all strange and screwed up? Well. That's something we will have to see soon. In about hopefully 20 minutes. I will try to keep this house very sure. Well, this let's build. This isn't a tutorial because I have no idea what I'm doing at the moment. So we have to call it a let's build. But I will I will I tend to keep it well, uh, well I will keep it quite short, maybe, maybe add a window here and upstairs. So that's the idea of the whole place at the moment. So let's just go down. I'm just gonna put down some light because it might get dark. There we go. And the stairs to the basement will be coming down here. So what we're gonna do is fill in this area with sandstone as well. Oops. All right, so. Whoa, shit. Oh, damn, we have a cave in. There's a huge cave here underneath the house. That is pretty cool, but we don't we won't investigate that now because we are building. We are actually trying to build at least. So let's see. Okay, so one more stair going down here. And I was tr thinking of maybe putting some elevations in this house like well, you will see. Hopefully it will turn out how I plan it to turn out. All right, so the stairs will be going down here. So let's just grab this and this and set five for wood. Pillar and the stairs will be turning here. Oh shit, we have a major cave in here. Everything is just going to hell with this build. Uh, let me just see stairs. Some more pillar support. All right. So the stairs will be ending here, and this will be the basement. So that will be three in height. So not what we can do is actually grab this block here, go all the way to this one, and set zero, which will clear out the whole area. Oh, and it will cave in a lot of stuff as well. But nevertheless, we have the in the area carved out at least so that's cool that is actually quite cool okay so first thing I'm gonna place the floor set five all right place the walls set 24 for sandstone oh 24 and this way in as well 24. All right, so now this is the basement level, which will be a pretty small room, but well, it will have to do because it's a small lot. So play, take this, take this, set five. There we go. Now we have the floor. Just gonna clear out a passage here. There we go. So we come in here, we go to the basement here. 
and I think my elevation idea will work out just great. I'm just gonna, well, actually I'm gonna just take this, take this, set 24. Whoa, shit. That was not good at all. I think I placed too many. Mark this, mark that. Set 24, there we go. All right, what we could have is actually windows going down to the basement here. Uh, let me just think. So if we delete this, we can place windows here. Delete this, place windows here. Make a pillar here, which will be just in line with the other pillar here. Delete this and place windows as well. And this windows will actually be going all the way up, I think. So let's take it up for now. And we're gonna work something out later on here. In the building process, there we go. Take it up here as well. And here we can actually maybe place a pillar here, which will add some nice feature to the whole thing. Oh, well actually this windows can go up all the way up as well. I'm, I'm just placing blocks all over the place. Alright, so one more. Like this. And I will think I will put the schematic on my on my website once this is done. Yeah, that's looking cool. That's looking cool. That is looking cool. Okay, so now we have this part which will be the how the thing which comes out. So you can see my idea is to bring this out like this. So there will be a room here. And I think these windows will have to go away because otherwise the room will be very small. Maybe to here. Turn this. Maybe free like this now. Let's keep it like this. Yeah, that will do. So the, the room will still be, be pretty big in size. It will be four in width here, which is just great because we will be able to place beds if wanted. So that is cool. And actually what we're gonna do is place, oops, uh, we're gonna place a basement here underneath this as well on an elevation. So we need to have windows going that to the basement as well. There we go. And windows here. And maybe here. It is not looking very pretty. I'm gonna delete this and put a pillar here instead. Well, let's just think now. So three in height, because this area will be lower than the main house itself. So three in height should be just enough for this space. And I don't know, guys, I don't know. I don't really like the look of this at the moment, but 10 minutes from now, we will know how this will look like. And hopefully it will look pretty So this support pillar can actually go, go all the way through the roof, maybe later on. Because that might look very cool. Okay, maybe too high. Maybe delete some. There we go. Uh, and as well, we can add a balcony here. So let's just place the floor inside of the second floor. So let me see, there we go. And that will be here. So mark this, mark that, set five, and we got a floor, so that's cool, that's cool. Okay, so now we can actually bring out a door here to a balcony maybe on the front, which will go all the way around here. But honestly, that doesn't work very good because, well, let me see, let's place, oh, it's not working very good. 
Let's place a pillar here, delete this one. Hmm. Because I was thinking of something like this, putting a white wall balcony like this, but as you can see it will just destroy this whole window shape here, so we can't have two windows in a row. And I'm very sad about that, but well, nothing we can do, so let's fill this place in like this, maybe. And now we can take out a balcony railing. Railing will only, well, the balcony will be only one block on the inside, but what is there to do? And delete those windows here all the way. Well, nothing we can do about it so let's not cry about it now let's finish the project here okay so now we got this shape going which is quite nice connect it here bring this all the way up like this windows windows i don't know Let's cover up the, the, the first room here and take it out, maybe delete this like this. So mark this, mark that, T said 35, 15, oh shit, I have done a shortcut command here, there we go. Because white wool is my favorite and it looks very strange now. Let's fill in the other roof as well and see how that looks. And once again, this isn't tutorial at the moment, because I have no idea what I'm doing, so... And fill that in as well. Okay, so now we got this shape going. And it's looking all strange. Window all the way up here. I am not enjoying this, but well, let's head on to the inside. So as you can see, we we're gonna have one room here which is, will be pretty small, but still we can have a bedroom or something. We'll have the main room here, we'll have a basement here, and we'll as well have a room here, I was thinking of. So let's clear out this area inside of this room. And actually what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna maybe just chop it down to here, mark this, mark that, set zero. All right, so we've cleared out this area. I'm typing furiously, furiously. All right, mark this. Set 24. There we go. Floor wood. Set 5. And that really sucked. That really sucked. There we go. Set. Turn off the rain. Make it day. There we go small room but it's looking quite small so we need to make a window here which goes all the way to the floor because that will give us some space and the room will maybe look a bit bigger with this window here well it doesn't but well hey all right so that's looking pretty cool on the upstairs here we're gonna do it like this place a railing maybe delete this whole thing here all right so that's there and place something like this just to give you some space here for the balcony door and we can place a bed or something here later on but I am not happy with the outside at all. It looks really strange. I'm not happy with this side at all. So we need to fix that. If we delete those windows here and maybe place blocks all around like this. I am not happy with that at all because it looks strange here in the shape. So let's see if we take out a ledge maybe. And bring it down here. 
maybe take out a pillar from this as well. And that actually looks quite much better because it gives us some some nice shapes going here. So that we will keep uh, for sure. Let me see the pillar on the inside is is here. So take it up. Do 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 wooden stone slabs. Stone slabs are cool. Place stone slabs here and just cover it up. There we go. And 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 maybe take up this like that to give it some strange shape going. And that's actually working quite quite alright. Maybe actually take out the roof one more here. Yeah, that looks a lot better. A lot better place a block on the inside one there. Alright, so now we have this shape quite nicely laid out. So let's maybe delete. Oh! There we go. Place some windows here, like this. Doesn't work very well. Let me place a ledge here. Looks much better, but we're gonna delete this one here. Wooden log. There we go. So that shape is looking nice and pretty. All right, I'm quite happy. Oh shit, we forgot about the pillars here. Maybe take it around like this. And have I have a path? I was thinking about the tree here in this area, which I was speaking of before. So if the tree comes here in the middle, the path will have to go something like this. And I think I'm gonna take it out here. So place a pillar here, pillar there. And that looks strange. Maybe this will look better. It actually looks quite alright. So guys, I'm talking to myself. I am very sorry because I am very, very in, into this build at the moment. And I'm thinking of what the hell is the next step? What shall I do? And I'm all focused and hyped. And I'm focusing. I am focusing. Something like this maybe. And actually we can place a bush here. And maybe a trapdoor for preventing us from falling down. Maybe on the there we go. No, that looks very dangerous. So let's place it there. All right. So the tree will be here. So what we're gonna do here is placing some grass block because we will grow a tree here soon. Grass block here a light to the tree there and now let's focus on this side maybe let's maybe make a path stone slabs maybe a bush and i know people hate gravel but i'm gonna use gravel anyways just to piss you off because as i've said a lot of times before the gravel in Misa look quite nice because it's looking like small, nice, cozy pebbles. There we go. And maybe gravel here as well. And that is looking pretty nice. And I think something have caved in here in the front of the house. So let's fill up this area. All right. And now we're gonna focus maybe, gonna, let's go place some bush here. And well, a bush which should look like vines. And I don't really like the other vines because they are spreading like disease all over the place and destroying the 
the nice layout of the house. I'm gonna use this vines, this type of vine instead. There we go. That is looking pretty and witty. So I'm gonna keep that. This part is looking quite cool. I think it's time to spawn a big tree. Actually, it's not because we haven't placed any doors. So let's find a door here. There we go. There's the doors, and let's place them from the inside. So door here and door there, and one door here on the upstairs as well. So guys, a quick tour above area. We have our room here, which is looking quite cool, actually. We have the ground floor, which is really small. We have one more room, and we have the basement, which you can use some like storage area or something. I'm actually going to place a pillar here, pillar here, and a pillar here, maybe. There we go. So, I think I'm done to spawn a big tree. I'll be right back. So guys. people, I've spawned a big big tree which is looking just amazing actually because it fits very well. I've groomed it a bit here on this side but nevertheless it's a very pretty and nice looking tree. So are we done? I think we are quite happy. Actually we maybe can do a pillar here as well. Let me just see how that looks. like this which will be a big big support pillar for something something well actually i was thinking once i'm at it i might just add some windows here let me head on the inside of the build take out our windows uh, run up run up run up all right let me see maybe we can add some roof windows here all the way around here and then maybe on this oh shit this is looking strange why is this looking so strange all right we forgot all right so that has to go back otherwise it looks very strange whoops whoops oh i'm placing blocks everywhere there we go Take this out here instead, like this. Oh, just I don't know. Oh well, I'm just gonna leave it for that for now. All right. So maybe actually this window here could go something like this here. Maybe all the way. Now it will be too much windows. So guys. I'm gonna I'm lost in my own house here all right there we go there's the exit there's the exit I am grateful for your time and hopefully you enjoy this build uh, the schematic can be downloaded from keralis.net and guys please do like comment or subscribe if you haven't and I will see you in the next video take care and bye